हेलो एवरीवन मैं सेल्फ दर्पण लालानी सॉल्यूशन आर्किटेक्ट सॉफ्टवेयर एजी इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू दैट हाउ कैन वी कन्वर्ट आवर एग्जिस्टिंग विजेट इनटू ए प्लगइन एज वी ऑल नो दैट आवर क्यूमुलोसिटी 1016 सपोर्ट्स प्लगइन सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग टाइम लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड ओके सो एज अ फर्स्ट व्हाट वी आर गोइंग टू डू इज दिस इज आवर डेमो विजेट एंड व्हिच वी आर गोइंग टू कन्वर्ट इनटू अ प्लगइन so this widget is a open source widget and available on software edge's github site so i will just click on this button to get the code and i will clone this repository i already created a, a demo folder where i don't have anything at the moment i will just go here execute git clone my repository okay so now you can see i do have my demo widget available here which is having the all the source code for the widget now as a next step let me go to the command prompt so first thing is now we need to check our ch2y cli version so i will just type the command to check the version and my version is 10.16 it is recommended that for the plugins you use kimrosity version 1015 or later now we are going to create a new project when you type ch2cli new it will up, it will ask you the various options that which is the what is your project name as a first step so let me give it as a kimrosity demo plugin now in the next step cli will ask us that which version we wanted to use so we will going to select 1016 here you can always use upper and down arrow key to to select a different option in the next option we need to select the template which we are going to use just keep pressing your down arrow until you find the widget plugin and then select it it will take few seconds to create your project Okay, so our project is created in the left side, Kimlocity demo plugin. Let's go inside and execute npm install. Okay, so now everything is installed and looks good to me. There is no error during the installation process. So now our step one is completed. We successfully created our plugin project. Step two is we need to copy our widget from demo widget into a plugin so inside the demo widget just go to the project folder source lib and you will find the various artifacts so basically when you create a widget there are few things which you require like a module services couple of components config component and main component and its corresponding html css files if you have so what we are going to do is we will copy all these files the select is and in our demo widget plugin we we'll create a new folder called demo widget and we will paste all our files there one more thing we require is we need a index file so if you observe in your demo widget plugin you will already have a folder called widget where you find the sample widget which we got as part of the template creation so what we are going to do is let's copy this index.ts file or maybe you can create a new one as well in our folder and just export our demo widget module and now we don't need this folder anymore at the moment so i can just delete it or you can keep it as it is the next step what we are going to do is we also need to update app module so app module basically use if you wanted to test your plugin locally using npm run start so let me remove the widget module because we already deleted that folder we don't have any more and i will introduce my demo widget module and also please mention that you have the proper path mapping there local testing okay 
So now our step two is completed. Let's move towards the step three. Step three is basically in our package JSON file. You will find some interesting steps here. For example, inside the CHY applications, you will find a new functionality called exports and remotes. So basically, in one project, you can have multiple plugins. In our case, we are only doing an example with a demo widget plugin. But in real scenario, you may configure more than one plugin in a single project. So let's modify these steps here. And demo widget plugin. We also need to give the name of the module. So in our case, in our GP demo widget module, I will copy the name of the module here. Path, we also have a different path. So I will give here demo hyphen widget and my path of my file, basically the module name dot ts file. Description, I can also modify that this is sample widget plugin and inside the remote entry i also need, need to give the same widget module name so that's all what we need to modify in package json of course you can also modify the version number if you want but i'm just going with the default at the moment and let's build it Okay, so my plugin project is now compiled and build it successfully. Now there is two ways you can deploy this into the Kimbo City. Either you can use npm run deploy and follow the instruction, or I can just go to the my dist folder and select all the assets inside the uh, in in my plugin folder. Inside the dist app in your plugin name will be there. Just select everything and create the zip out of that. Okay, so I should have my plugin binary ready for the deployment. Let's go to the Kimlo City. So this is the tenant, and inside your administration app, go to the application and then go to the packages. Here, you will find all the plugins which already installed or if you don't have any. In our case, I'm just going to install our demo widget. I will click on add package button and I will select the binary. So I do have the zip file which just now we created. Let's install it. Okay, so my package is created in Gimlocity platform. I can see the Gimlocity demo plugin with version 10.16.0.191. Let's click on that. And here you will find the install plugin option. So we installed the package. Now we are installing, going to install the plugin. And now this plugin I'm going to install in application builder as well as in cockpit. I do have cockpit 10.16 app in my tenant yes i want to proceed yes now plugin is storing both of my application let's see and test it first i will go to the cockpit 1016 so now we are in cockpit 1016 uh, let me try to edit our widget yes demo widget is available let me pick one of the device and let's see yes our demo widget is coming here with data loading so it's working perfectly fine in cockpit let's try and test inside the application builder so i have created one app called demo app with uh, application builder you can see in the context path it is a application builder app let me log in uh and let Try to add the same widget here. Yes, demo widget is available. Let me select the device. Yes, it's working perfectly fine with application builder as well. So friends, in this session, you learn about 
how can we convert our existing widget into a plugin also we learn about the ctry cli command to create a new plugin project from the scratch and also how can we install and deploy our plugins into multiple applications so friends i converted my widget into a plugin now it's time for you to convert your widget into a plugin and try this out thank you for watching